Hey guys, so this is the look that I created for you guys today. I used the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette. I absolutely love it. And if you want to see how I got this makeup look, keep on watching. Hey okay guys, so let's get started. First, I'm gonna start off by priming my face. I'm using the Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. I'm getting ready for For everywhere else, I'm going to use the Elf Hydrating Primer. Just take one. Alright, now I'm going to do my eyebrows. I'm going to start with the ColourPop Dope Taupe Brow Color. I'm just going to do this and a little angled dual ended brush by Eco Tool. I'm going to take the Anastasia Brow Rose in the shade Dope Taupe. For that, I'm going to take the NYX Eyeshadow Base in Neutral, or Skin Tone, and a flat synthetic concealer brush. And I'm just going to do that, do that, some of that. And then just clean up my eyebrows. I'm going to take the BH Cosmetics Flawless Brow Gel. I have it in clear and set our brows in place. Okay, now we're going to go into the eyes. And first we're going to prime our eyes with, or prime our eyelids with the Photo Focus Eyeshadow Primer by Wet and Wild. And now we can move into the palette and set our eyes. So for today's look, I am using the Modern Renaissance Eyeshadow Palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. So this palette right here. So I'm going to start off by taking the shade Rossi Eno right here with a fluffy um, blending brush. So. Now with the brush that came in the Anastasia palette, we're taking the blending side and we're gonna go into Burnt Orange right here, right next to Rossi Anna. And we're putting that right over top of Rossi Anna. Now 
Now we're going to take red ochre with the other side of the Anastasia Dual Ended Brush and we're going to place that in the outer corner and inner corner of our eye. So we want to do like almost like a halo eye, so we want to leave the middle blank. Now we're just going to take more of that um, burnt orange and blend uh, the crease out. Now we're going to take the e.l.f. professional eyeshadow brush, we're going to um, Spray it with some makeup mixing fist by Pixie. And then we are going to go into Vermeer right here. So with the brush wet, we're gonna go into Vermeer. And we're gonna place that right in the middle. So to blend this out, we're gonna go back into Venetian Red. Sorry, not Venetian Red. We're gonna go back into Red Ochre. And just blend out those edges. Now we are going to do a wing. To do my wing, I'm going to take the BH Cosmetics Studio Pro Waterproof Gel Liner in Onyx. And I'm going to take this no-name angled liner brush that I bought from Christmas Tree Shops. One dollar, that's all I remember, no name. Okay, so that's done. Now let's move on to our face before we finish our eyes. I'm going to take the Becca Under Eye Brightening Corrector. This is what it looks like. And I like to put this on my dark circles before I put my foundation. I used to put it over top of my foundation and it just wasn't working. Now I'm just going to, with my damp beauty blender, just um, blend that out a bit. Alright, so now for the first time I'm going to try the L'Oreal Pro Glow Foundation. I got this for $9 at CVS.com. Got this for $9 at CVS.com. I got it in the shade 205. I feel like it's a little too light, but let's see.
Now we're gonna go take the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NC20 and conceal under Now to set the concealer in place, I am going to take a little wedge that I bought. So cute, I think. And the RCMA No Color Powder. I'm going to bronze my face using the Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer in the shade Bronzer with a dual fiber brush by Beach Cosmetics and just I'm going to take a big fluffy brush like so and Okay, so to contour my face, I'm using the Kat Von D um, Shade and Light Contour Palette, and I'm going to go into the shade Lyric and further brighten under the eyes. So Lyric is this middle shade right here, and I'm just going to brighten under my eyes. Now I'm going to take this S SL Miss Glam 07 small contour brush that I got my It's Glam bag and I'm gonna go into these two shades, Lyric and, no not Lyric, Subconscious and Shadow Play Favorite and Contour my base. So now to set the rest of my face, I'm going into my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Medium Dark with my big fluffy brush. And just pat that. And just to set that rest of my face. Alright, All right, so we're just going to take this and then wipe off that right here. Wipe it off, wipe it off. Okay, go. Perfect. Perfect. Face off. I'm gonna take my personalized MAC palette and I'm gonna take this blush right here. It is called Blush Baby with a Morphe E4. Best blending brush ever. So we're done with that. Now everyone's favorite part, highlighting. So I'm going to take the Laura Geller Gilded Honey Highlighter and I'm just going to take this e.l.f. fan brush and just go into that.
Now we're gonna finish off the face with some Pixie Makeup Mixing Fist. brush that looks like a pointed brush we're gonna go into tempera and highlight the brow bone and highlight the inner corner Now we're going to take this Asante Kajal Intense Waterline Liner in Intense Black and line our waterline. And now we're going to take a mixture of Perversion Mascara and Smashbox Mascara and put them on both my top lids and my bottom eyebrow, eye, eyelashes. So top eyelashes and bottom eyelashes, both. You can start with either or, either or it doesn't matter. So now we're gonna finish off by doing our lips and for this look, I wanted to do a nude lip and I'm going to take the new Urban Decay Vice Lipstick and this is in Stark Naked. So pretty packaging. going to finish off the lip with this Sephora gel, what is it? It's just a Sephora gel lip gloss in 02 Cappuccino, my favorite lip topper. Oh, I'm obsessed with it. This is the finished lip. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Please don't forget to comment down below, like, and subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. So yes, more um, tutorials will be coming up very soon on my channel. I know I've been doing a lot of hauls and stuff like that, but more makeup looks are coming your way. And if you want more makeup looks, please like and subscribe so I know that you want me to do more makeup looks, all right? So until next time, my friends, bye. Mwah! <sniffs>